Okay, we're in. It can be a little bit of a... can take a little bit of time to go from the uh, setting screen to, to here to start the mission. Right, the first thing I always do is I always hit the tilde key, which is below your escape and above your tab. Hit supports and go on switch off fatigue. Because I hate the armor 3 fatigue system. I think it's absolutely bloody ridiculous. That's a nice sight to start with. Right, um, where am I? Am I where I think I am? I am. Actually, no, I'm not. Am I near Sophia? Yes, I am. But there's a spawn here. That's where I thought I was. Okay. Right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to head to the first church. Now, a little note about putting markers down. It's a bit bugged at the moment. And I think it's an armor. I'm not sure if it's an armor issue or if it's um, to do with this mission. So what I do is I put a marker down to tell me where I want to go. I don't then go and... What you used to be able to do was to get rid of the markers because you couldn't, you couldn't just delete them. You can delete that one, but you can't delete that one. So what I used to do was I used to just put them over my thing and they'd, they'd cancel each other out and disappear. They don't anymore. This is since their armor update um, that happened on a few days ago. So it's a pain in the neck. So I don't think it is. I think it is armor actually because it's the same version I... Okay, yeah, I've got to got to do this. There we go. There we go. One kilometre. Right. I'll see you there. Ah, oh, maybe I'll put it around. Did I flip it around or something? That's smooth, because I thought... Okay, let's get rid of that. Put that back. Is there one behind me? Yeah, okay. I just had them the wrong way around. Ah! What? Why would that put another one? I just wanted to move that one to the seat. I've got an extra one that I don't want already. How annoying. Okay. Oh, that's alright. I think I might be able to cancel that one out just by running over it. So I'm going to put that here. So I am running this, um, this mod that Rydigia um, created for this particular mission called Incognito, which means if you put your weapon in your backpack, oh, this one won't fit. Backpack's too small. Has it got anything else in that backpack? Yes, it has. I don't think it'll fit in that. Yes, it will. So normally it would say you're safe or you're undetected or something. That's not going to disappear, is it? No. Nope. Just get my backpack back out. South. One, two to four men. This could be a hidden camp. This could be a, this is perfect. South. Right, I think it's going to be probably the other side of that hill. So, um, don't know if how many of you have noticed that since the. I'm just going to go and have a look, see if that's got up. Nice again. Um, since the also since the armor update, no range finders work. So that includes um, laser designators don't work anymore. They don't give the range. Uh, I'll take it. I always delete the boxes, even if I I sell the boxes, even if I if they got nothing in because they don't despawn otherwise, and you might come across it again and look in it. Um, yeah. So range finders don't work. Um, also, if you've got the, is it the Night Hawk scope that actually uh, gives you the range? That doesn't work either. Um, laser designators, none of them. They do all the other stuff but the range. So, yep. Once again, Bohemian Interactive brings out an update, and then we'll have to fix the update. Hostile, yeah. Let's just 
to show you. I've just paid for that, so that was uh, 600 fuel fund. There we go. I know there's a hostile presence there. It could be one guy, or it could be a battle. See, I was over that way there, wasn't I, when it said so it could be over there. So Sophia's over that way where that tower thing is. Actually. Yeah, and that could be that could be a stronghold over there, so we'll look. Yes, that's a I th actually that could be those guys. Although they seem to be a long no, this is a stronghold. There's a guy in the tower. So you go and kill all the guys there. Some of them might surrender. There'll be an officer, a high-ranking officer, and these guys are a lot more dangerous. They're, I don't know, they might be 100%. Um, they might be 90%, I don't know. I don't know what the normal AI ability is. So I don't think I'm going to find a hidden camp just yet. but. So that's a stronghold, so sometimes they can have tanks there and stuff. That seems to have an overturned Ifrit. Not sure what happened there, whether it attacked and or if it just spawned in upside down or something. See the other thing when when Bohemian Interactive update Armor 3. The amount of missions that get completely screwed up. Now those guys seem to be wandering off, so... They're the same faction, though, as the guy who's up in the tower. So there's a guy down there as well. If I had a long-range scope, scope, I'd be trying to take those guys out now. Because there isn't a tank there, and the Ifrit's on its roof, so if it had a gun on it, it wouldn't be firing at me. Oh, okay. Now they're those guys at the military place, aren't they? Yeah. So there's only an engineer and a team leader, yeah. So if those guys left, I could actually get in there, kill those guys, and get some uh, really good intel. Uh huh. No, I can't see enough. Oh, I forgot, I've got a decent scope. See, I'm not used to playing on these settings. I can see one guy's head, possibly. The other thing is, and they still haven't fixed this, if you shoot through leaves of a tree, the leaves deflect the bullet. I've had it happen time and time again on my long play series. It's ridiculous. Uh, is it two or three? I can see two. Is there a guy by the... F There's a guy sitting in the fire, isn't there? How far away is that? Let's have a look. Uh, I'd say... I'd say that's 400. It sits 400. That's... Two down. One to go. Three down. Sometimes the last guy might surrender. There you go. Got a launcher, that'd be quite nice. Yeah, a lot of the time they have uh, Mark 20s, or whatever they're called. Mark 20, Mark 20. Sometimes you get one with a Mark 18, no? Haha. <laughs> See? Right, uh, I, yeah, I always turn the fire off first, and I just gave you a good demonstration of why I do that. Take that off. Uh, I like to unload guns before I put them away. Oops. Actually, yeah, that other guy had a backpack, so I'll I'm gonna put six to nine men east. Okay, that's all right. Uh, quite a lot. 
I don't think they'll be coming here because these guys... Well, I don't know, actually. Right, this is the team leader, so I'm going to get information. Which will probably be radio uh, frequency, so... Yep, there you go. So now, whenever a... Um, Oh, pistol, that's quite nice. Chest rig. Med pack. Did I, did I put a med pack in here? So why the hell didn't I have a med pack already? You always start with a med pack. That is really odd. Can I cannot understand that. Oh, that's why. I forgot about that. 9.3. Right, I'm going to take East Carrier Rig because it's got level 3 protection. I'm going to take this. Uh, let's just sell all the weapons first. Only one of them, only the team leader will have information. Uh, which one was the one that had uh, a backpack? Uh, uh, didn't one of them have a backpack? I am imagining things. No, none of them have got backpacks. Now, if you find one of them has got the explosive resistant um, rig, I would get. I would recommend taking it. Guess you know. Now, I've already got one of these with a grenade launcher on it, so. Just gonna take that out. Sorry. Put it in there. Put it in there. Sell the gun the way it is, because I don't really care about the uh, I'm gonna sell that uh, damn it. let's put my backpack back on. I'm gonna sell that rig. I'm gonna sell that sight. Well my binocular doesn't have put them in by accident, I don't know how. Taken all that? No, I haven't. Which one was the one that had the. Uh... Okay, I think I'll keep the one with the launcher. That would be smart, really, wouldn't it? Yep. Take the scope off. Okay. And swap over. Take the ammo out. Now I could, um, when I go to do whatever I go to do next, oh did I already take his, uh, no I didn't, what sort of scopes it got, MRCO, ok so I can sell an MRCO scope as well then, ok that's him. His pistol gets sold with the rest of his gear. Oh, I've got to take his pistol ammo, but never mind. What about you? You've got pistol ammo, haven't you? Not really a big deal. I bet he hasn't actually. I think I'll have to do this. There we go. Another med pack. That's it. That's all I need from him. Bye. Right, um, that was, I might as well sell the MRCO scope, sell that pistol, oh did you hear that, there's a vehicle coming, um, This is why I turn the fire off, because it's the fire is where you establish hideout, so... Now, they didn't... I haven't seen any messages about... Um, not hearing a signal from this place or something. Right, so then you can sell the stuff out of there. 
Should get a reasonable amount for that, actually. I think that might be that commish. So as you can see on the map now, I can leave here and I can travel freely back from anywhere as long as I'm not in a hostile area or in combat, I think. That's how it works. That vehicle. Not seeing what it is. Okay. Um, so the next job would be to go to our first chapel, which is what we were going to do before, but now we've got ourselves a... I could actually, if I wanted to, I could take this in my backpack, but to be honest it takes up so much space. I've got... how many... I've got 20 rounds? 30... 60 rounds, I mean. Okay, Let's see if we can get up here without... Oh, isn't this where those nine guys were going? This way? East, wasn't it? Usually means they were because it said they were, the footprint uh, footsteps were going east. Actually, we don't need to go east anyway. Oh look! Oh, and we got a checkpoint. This is our first checkpoint. So as you can see, there's oh that's nasty. That's an Ifrit with a with a grenade launcher on it. That is really nasty. Let's have a look. Okay, he's a he's a um, AT guy, so he that isn't a fixed position. Um, these are the guys I saw, so it was what, six to nine? There's an officer there, just down in there. Um, see how many gun positions there are. See, it's not always easy to see them, so there might be one along that road. See, that one does not look like a gun position to me, it looks like a guy with a... with a missile launcher, yeah. That's the officer. Yeah, he's got the barrier on it. That thing will wreck you so quick. Okay, so at least we know where those guys are. Now what I normally do is, once I've stripped the bodies and stuff, I usually go supports, clean up wrecks and bodies. There you go, they're all gone now. Oh, it's a BTR of some kind. Oh, no, it's not. It's the thing. It's the... No, it isn't. For a second, I thought it was the unmanned thing. If you can find the operator. Never found him yet, but... I think it's... If it is the unmanned thing, that's got a hell of a gun on it as well. No, it's not. It's, um... That's a, not a Mora. That's, uh, is that a Kaddish? Uh, no, it's not. Yeah, Marid. Okay. Yeah, I've had a Marid. I think the Marid's the one that's um, amphibious. I had it on uh, Bornholm. Right. Now, if I can get to a road, I could actually... Use some assets to check my fuel fund. 3,890. Change to grenade. What's hanging around here for? Maybe so we've got um, ambient combat and high, <laughs> limited. Yeah, I could, uh, I could hit choke from that road down there. I think. Sounds really close. No, it's it's having trouble. I hate being near rocks. See the Marine's like a BTR ninety, isn't it? But amphibious, because I don't think the BTR ninety is amphibious. I'm almost certainly the 
Murid is. Actually, the Murid, isn't that the one that has the glitched gun that always looks like it's firing? Can't tell. Right, let's get down to this road and see if we can... <clears throat> I don't know if it'll let me. Because look, I'm not getting an option to go back to my uh, camp. That's because I looked at that vehicle, I think. Or maybe it was because I looked at the uh, the other, well, either of them. There was a church here, look. So this is a good place to end this episode then. So this is your primary objective, is to go to all the chapels. Hopefully you won't have to go to all of them. I think in my, uh, my last series on... <coughs> There you go, I've got the radio. This should save any second. Sometimes it can be a bit slow. It's usually slow on the one with the body. I mean, really slow. Okay, and then it should say, yeah, 217 to go. So there you go, it's uh, put that in. So if I get circle intel that says, um, you always know if it's good circle intel because it'll do a save or you'll get a load of writing coming up on the bottom of the screen because either they want you to kill someone in which case you've got a lot of writing or it'll do a save and then knock a load of churches off because it's like you've been to all those churches so I'm going to end this episode in here I think so I think um, this has covered a couple of things um, so thanks for watching please comment, rate, subscribe and I will see you in the next episode bye for now